one wrong decision by the driver of this Toyota Land Cruiser has led to this terrible road accident in Chibombo area of Central Province. He wanted to overtake the post bus that was coming from the Copper Belt, but hit the oncoming truck, making the truck to lose control. It was at this point that the truck laden with Milimio went to the lane of the oncoming post bus, causing a head-on collision at about 07.30 hours in the morning. <laughs> So yes, that's what I'm control. I'm going to in the bus. I think bus is going to be in the bus. I'm going to be in the The bus had over 70 passengers on board, from which over 50 died on the spot. Chiwombo District Medical Officer Priscilla Chisha gave more details. The bodies that we have recorded so far are 51. Just here on the site where we have, we have 31 bodies that have already been loaded on a truck. And then we have 14 bodies at the theater and 6 that have already gone to Cabo General Hospital. Deputy Minister of Home Affairs Stephen Campiongo and Central Province Minister Philip Kosam both described the accident as a national disaster. Uh, it's, it's something that has never happened uh, for some, some years. So we are looking at uh, the best ways of uh, uh, being on the road. You cannot describe uh, this tragedy as, uh, as a disaster. You know, uh, losing such a huge number of uh, you know, our citizens at uh, one go. And Zampost Director of Operations Alex Mayer says the bus is insured and any claims submitted by the victims would be addressed accordingly. Uh, we are covered by insurance, so uh, any claims related to this uh, to be covered by Away from the accident spot, one survivor, Jita Momba, who was found at Liteta Hospital, shared what she could remember. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what people saw, but I've been told a truck hit the middle of the bus. So that's how come it overturned. But we didn't see anything because most of us who survived mm -hmm. are from the back. Bruce Mali, Movie TV News, Chibombo, Central Province.